Well, moving on now, Queensland's Premier is pleading with residents to get vaccinated as figures show the Sunshine State has one of the lowest rates in the country. A new campaign will see a text message sent to every Queenslander urging them to book in for the jab. The vaccine rollout has been slow to kick off, but while it's picked up in other states, Queensland remains in last place. Of eligible Queenslanders, 53.33% have had at least one dose and 34.75% um, of eligible Queenslanders are fully vaccinated. In a major push to get more jabs in arms, the state government has launched a new campaign. Every single person with a mobile phone in Queensland will soon get a text. Now we do that during um, when we're in uh, natural disasters. We have that capability to do that. We're going to be sending out text messages to people to be able to tell you where your closest vaccination centre is. There are 80 state-run vaccination centres in Queensland and more mass vaccination hubs, pop-up and mobile clinics will be coming online soon, targeting areas where the vaccine rates are lagging, like the Isaac region, where just 26% of eligible people have had their first dose. We are very concerned about what's happening in New South Wales and Victoria and now Queensland is your window of opportunity to get vaccinated. Our risk is closer than it's ever been before. It is right on our border. But Commonwealth documents show although Queensland has the lowest vaccine rate... Their own report online today, dated the 6th of September, actually shows that Queensland is fully utilising their stock. Soon, Queenslanders will have another vaccine to choose from. Today, I'm here to introduce you to our new weapon in fighting COVID-19, which is Moderna. It will be available in 1,200 community pharmacies across the country by the end of next week. We will have over 10 million Moderna vaccines available in Australia before the end of the calendar year. Georgia Simpson, Sky News.